Hello everyone! In this video I show you how to disassemble the Canon EF 100mm f2.8 USM macro lens to get access to the aperture unit. Recently I had this lens with aperture problems. The aperture didn't work and it was caused by a bent aperture blade. So I had to disassemble the lens, replace the aperture unit with a new one and then assemble the lens. In this video I show you how to disassemble the lens. This video is part of video series about repairing a Canon 100mm f2.8 USM macro lens. In this first video I show you how to disassemble the lens, and next video is about assembling the lens. If you're interested in that, then the link in, is in the description below. Before I will start, let me talk about the tools that I will use to disassemble the lens. I will use a PH30 screwdriver, a PH20 screwdriver, a plastic spudger or plastic tweezers, a metal tweezers, a wood screw, and a permanent marker. If you're interested in buying them, then the links are in the description below. I hope this video will be useful, helpful, informative, and adds value to you. If that's the case, like this video, subscribe to my channel, send me a donation, or buy a camera or lens from my webshop. Links in the description below. If you have anything to add to this video, then share it in the comment section below. And in the description there is an update section. If I have anything to add to this video after it has been posted, then I put it there. So I would highly recommend to check it. So let's get started. This is the lens which will be disassembled. Remove the screws from the electronic connector. Remove the screws from the bayonet. Lift up the bayonet a little bit on the other side of the electronic connector, then push the covering up. Be careful not to damage the flex cable between the electronic connector and the PCB. Disconnect the flex cable of the rear cover. Remove the rear cover. Disconnect the flex cables. Remove the PCB. Remove the screws from the rear of the lens. Remove the rear cover.
Remove the screws from the USM motor. Remove the USM motor. Mark the plastic slide rings and the lens tubes. The marked parts of the lens are eccentric screws and they should be at the same position after they were assembled. Those six screws on the rear of the lens will not be removed to remove the aperture unit. Use a metal tweezers to lift up the front lens covering a little bit and use a plastic spudger to remove it. Remove the three screws which are holding the front cover. Remove the front lens cover. Mark the position of the front lens element, remove the three remaining screws and remove the front lens. Next step is to remove the rear lens element. First mark the position of it, then remove the three screws and then the rear lens element itself.
The flex cable is attached to the inner wall of the lens tube. Zoom back and use a plastic spudger to remove it. Move the front lens element to the front, so it will be easier to remove. Remove the screws and sliders, then the focusing lens element will fall off. Mark the focusing lens element, so it will be easier to assemble. Remove the screw from the aperture flat cable and the three screws which are holding the aperture unit. After the screws have been removed, the aperture unit slides out. Make sure that the flex cable is not adhered to the lens tube. We finished disassembling the lens. Join me in the next video where I show you how to assemble the lens. Link in the description below. I hope this video was helpful, useful, informative and added value to you. If that's the case, then please like this video, subscribe to my channel, send me a donation, or buy a camera or lens from my eBay webshop. The link is in the description below. If you have anything to add to this video, then share it in the comment section below. So thank you very much for watching and looking forward to meet you in one of my other videos.